two three four seven zero. Wind two nine zero at one zero. Visibility one zero. Sky clear. Temperature two. November 61959 with a high-fire request. Be actually with a VFR request. 61959 or go left to ground, change to my frequency, 121.7, say request. 1.7. You said VFR request? Yeah, VFR practice approach to Montgomery. November 61959 would like a VFR practice approach to Montgomery. 1.959. 9959 cleared through the cross proper airspace on departure, turn right heading 165. Radar vectors to Montgomery Airport. Maintain VFR at 3,500. Departure frequency 124.35. Squawk issued by tower. Clear to the pass of Bravo airspace. Radar vector 165 to Montgomery. Altitude 3,500. Frequency 12435. Transponder will be assigned by tower. 61959. System 959, read back correct. Notify tower that you are VFR practice approach prior to departure. We'll notify tower VFR practice approach prior to departure. 619 So, Hello, one thing to make sure that you, uh, that you say clearly is it's a right turn heading 165 and then radar vectors to Montgomery. Right turn 165. Right. Yep. Taxi via Alpha 2 Bravo Delta, cross runway 35. Runway 27 right, Alpha 2 Bravo Delta, cross on 25, 72 Zulu. Thought you were saying timeout. No, no, you're good. Everybody breaks the permit even. Yours? I have controls. Controls? My controls. Breaks from an even. I have no leaks on my side. You have controls. Your controls. Your controls. Last calling ground, unreadable. Out to the right. Okay. Uh, sir, let's go across one seven to Charlie. Yes, Ground. This is Cessna 734, November Kilo at plus one. Requesting taxi to 27 right, we have Sierra. Cessna 734, November Kilo, go left to ground. 27 right, taxi oh. via Alpha. We're on VFR. I was about to say IFR taxi. Taxi via Alpha Delta across runway 35, 4 November Kilo. Cessna 4 November Kilo and verify runway 27 right. 27 right, yes sir, 4 November, 4 November Kilo. Let's begin to scan for seven Fox to the runway two seven left at Alpha request target American. So it's on two seven Gulf Fox Let's begin American taxi via Delta. Via Delta to American two seven Gulf Fox. Gulf Fox ground says a six one nine or five nine or at SA request taxi two seven right information Sierra. So it's on six one nine or five nine or Gulf Fox ground two seven right taxi via Alpha two Bravo Delta cross runway three five. Taxi via Alpha 2, Bravo Delta, cross one way 35, 619 or 
Joe, you're checking your instruments while you're turning? Right. Ball's out. Everything is good. So what instruments are you looking at? Uh, turn coordinator. Okay. I'm looking at the... Uh, at Plastic count. Attitude indicator. Is off at, uh, the attitude and what else? Uh, turn coordinator, attitude taxi indicator. Taxi V Alpha to American, six Zulu Papa. HSI and the compass. Okay, yeah, so you're, HSI. You're, you're looking at everything down here in the middle? The compass, yeah. Okay. Then you're also checking this one down here. Okay. Right, I'll go ahead and take the controls and then you can get set up for the departure. Okay. Um, when we come up to the turn, I want you to call out the the, the instruments. Make sure that they're properly. Okay. Can we, are we able to get the weather for Montgomery from here? Not from here, no. The mountains are too high. Okay. So. OS to Montgomery. Let me see. Center right is clear, we're turning right. Ball to the left, heading indicators going that way. Attitude indicators immediately up, and compass is swinging properly. And this attitude's good? Yes. Perfect. Same, that's going to be quick. Going to Montgomery? Yes. Okay. I'd say you, you, you still want to set a... That's the wrong knob. Still the wrong knob. Oh my gosh. <laughs> uh, which one should I set if that's if it's that close? It's it's your call. Okay. But you still want to make sure that you set a fix in. That way you, you have the whole approach. Why can't I load it? Um, you, you don't have to load it. It's okay if you activate it. It's just because we're so close. Exactly. Flight following at 6,500 to San Bernardino, San Bernardino, please. We at Palos. Oh, never mind. Now the ILS approach in the GPS doesn't have Palos. Okay. Um, so the way that you figure that out is you just have to look at the distances on the chart here and figure out figure that out in the GPS. Okay. Departure frequency 125.3, squawk 0212. Squawk 0212, touch base with SoCal on 125.3, expect a right downwind and stay clear of the class Bravo. 4 November Kilo. 4 November Kilo, read back correct, notify tower, flight following, VFR flight following, fire departure. We'll notify tower of flight following on departure, 4 November Kilo. And ground, uh, November 66 on the pop over at Circle at the Seltzer Fuel. We got the information that we're uh, Bravo Lima 8, we'd like flight following to Long Beach, and also permission to taxi to uh, 27 right. Hang on, so we already loaded it, right? Right. Oh, just push clear. Activated. Just push clear. Okay. Now if we go back here, it should already be activated. We don't have to do anything else at this point. Okay. Uh, the only thing that we have to do after this is activate the leg. That's by hitting menu. Now you got it. Uh, yep. So after you got the brakes? I got the brakes. You got the brakes. Okay, let me just do this. Stop. November Back to it. Parking brakes set, cabin's ready. You got your seatbelt on, everything? Okay, cool. Elevator trims set for takeoff. Flight controls. We're a Bravo Lima 8 and uh, 4,500.
500, Long Beach, please. 626, Alpha 5. Flight controls are good. Flight instruments. Okay. Number uh, six Alpha Papa, remain outside of the class Bravo airspace. Expect a right downwind departure. Departure frequency 125.3, squawk 0213. They said it was 2988, right? Yeah, they said it was 2988. That would actually be one more notch up. Right there. Good day. Right there. Okay. ground shell fuel at Alcon for Golden State. Shell fuel goes to ground, cross 65 Alpha 1. Cross 65 Alpha 1, shell fuel. After I hit menu, it'll say activate leg. Do I hit menu, enter again, or enter, or is it menu again? Just go ahead and push menu. Okay. So, push clear. Go down to a, a fix that we're not going direct to, like penny. Menu. It'll say activate leg, you'll push enter, and then it'll it'll activate it from there. Okay. All right. That's my worst, that's my worst fear. <laughs> that part of the procedure. <laughs> yep. Makes sense. So something that you kind of want to get in the habit of doing, especially for like stage checks and check rides, is that you're saying what you're doing through the checklist. Okay. Um, because if, if I'm an examiner and I'm watching you go through the checklist and I see you bring the power up, you check the mags, and then you know you quit, you go over the engine, just make sure there's no announcers, you just pull the power to idle. I don't know if that's what you actually did or not. Okay. All right. I'll try to do that more. Yep. Do better about that. Yep. Um, throttle friction lock. Zlin. Rear lights. I don't need that anymore. Okay. Ops are still up. Okay. Okay, so we're going to go to Montgomery. Be awesome. Yes, it will be. <laughs> we'll, uh, if we have any issues on the takeoff roll, we'll just hit the brakes and taxi off. If we hit the takeoff, but we still got runway in front of us, we'll just land. If we take off, but the runway's behind us, but we're under a thousand feet. Too bad, so sad. We'll just land forward and uh, in front of us. And if we're over a thousand feet, we'll make that turn to try runway nine. Okay. Left or right. Okay. Okay. It's the briefing. Okay. Excellent. Good. Okay. All right. So we're down here. It's going to be happening so fast. I'll just give you the approach briefing. Okay. For on the plate. Um, we're tuned in one one nine point or one one point nine five. That's the DME. The lo ILS localizer. Which course? I right, go ahead. The heading. Eight one. How do we track the course? Okay. We'll do that. It won't be that. It'll be the CI. Okay. So it should be that. Yeah. All right. So load one. Approach course three nine nine. Touchdown zone elevation be four two three. Will be climb to 1,100, then climbing to 3,000. But they'll, I imagine they'll give us something else since we're going to Brown after. Go for the missed approach? Yeah. Yep, probably. And 126.9, we set that up. USB ground, Skyline 737, Mike X ray, Alpha 27 right, request taxi to circle air. 
Something else you want to... 519er, runway 27 right, cleared for takeoff. Runway 27 right, cleared for takeoff, 619er, 59er. All I was going to say is, uh, next chance you get, um, you want to try to set the missed approach holding fix? Yes. Uh, what, you, 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 okay. um, you can keep going right now, Romeo, um, right, but just right. the, um, the next chance you get, make sure that you have that frequency set. 4 runway 27 right, clear to land. 4 runway 27 right, clear to land. for takeoff. Okay. Done that earlier. Something else that you can still do? There you go. Alive. Roger. 3550, 5 and rotate.
Alright, almost there. Right turn, one six five. Nine ship Papa, runway two seven left, clear to land. I have controls. Uh, we're controls. You can put the goggles on. Nine ship Papa, runway two seven left, clear to land. Runway two seven left, clear to land. Nine ship Papa. I almost forgot about that completely. All right, you ready? I'm ready. All right, you have controls. The controls. Thing else you want to do is as soon as you take off, or as soon as you are, you know, cleared for, cleared to take off, zoom this out. Okay. Other way. I'm flying the plane. Okay. <laughs> Perfect. Good choice. Five nine or contact SoCal departures. Contact SoCal departures. Six one nine or five nine. SoCal departure, November 61959, right turn heading 165. November 61959, SoCal approach, IDENT, advise information Juliet from Montgomery Field. IDENT will, will advise information Juliet from Montgomery, 61959. FedEx 6 heavy traffic, 7 o'clock and 3 miles northwest bound, altitude indicates 3100, type is unknown. Retire is mission Juliet. FedEx 6 heavy, Nine nine, contact on north of west. You are clear through Bravo Arch, heading one one zero. Maintain the car at a road of Port Dallas. Right. Sounds of advisory. Request for every contact ground control one eight point two two. All pilots should back hold for instructions. Center runway seven zero five. Altitude mis published in the supplements. The pilot number six one zero. Maintain the separation. Advise contact to evade information. Sorry, I missed that call. Can you repeat that? 61959 Cessna 61959, you are cleared through Crest Rubber via heading 110, maintain V4, out or below 4000, please. Heading 110, out or below 3000, 61959, thank you. Cessna 959, out or below 4000. Out or below 4,000, 619 or 500. FedEx 906 Heavy, reduce speed 170 knots or less, contact number tower 118.3. 170 or less, contact tower FedEx 906 Heavy. Delta 1025, so car approach, did I miss your check-in? Tower, you're busy, you're here at 127, thank you, Delta 1025. Delta 1025, thanks, descend via lucky one arrival, cleared RNAV or localizer approach, runway 27. Alright, cleared the uh, via lucky one and uh, RNAV, you Delta 1025. Cessna 959, say all your approach requests. I'd like to do the ILS at the Montgomery uh, runway 2 right. 20, 28 right. Cessna 959, was it see a full stop, sir? Negative, we'd like to do uh, a go around to and then proceed to uh, Brown Airport, 6959. Cessna 959, after Brown, did you want to go back to Blessy? Yes, sir. After the VOR Alpha to Brown, we'd like the localizer Delta take a last speed, and that'll be a full stop. 959. Cessna 959, Roger, all your approach run requests. Yeah, so when they say, say approach request, you're going to tell them everything you want to do. Okay. Yep. That's a 1025 traffic. All right, so now that we're going, let's, down, let's get this zoomed out. That way we can see where we're going. Feel twisted to press. Is that to the right? To the right. Keep going. Keep going. There you go. Okay. All right, so let's keep going. We're still going. I'll be going to 3-5 just because okay. that's, that's what I like. Or should I stay at 3,000 since it's IFR? Deal. So we're VFR right now. I'd say oh, three. Right. I'd say three five is fine. Okay. Okay. So we got the weather. I'm gonna listen to that again because I didn't get all of it. Advice contact. You have any information? Six one nine five nine. Turn right heading one eight zero. Right heading one eight zero six one nine or five nine. Two three five three zero. Wind three zero zero at nine. Visibility one zero miles. American twenty seven fifty eight. Traffic room in the vicinity of Windy. Altitude indicates two thousand seven hundred. Approach two eight right. Arrive departing two eight left and two eight right. Request for recast at ground control one eight point two two. All pilots should back hold for instructions and roaming assignments with the call sign. Altitude mis published. Delta ten twenty five. Traffic seven hundred eighty nine. Now one twenty seven feet MSL. Advise contact via this information Juliet. 
Cessna departure, Cessna 619 or 59 has Juliet, Montgomery. Cessna 959, Did you get the altimeter? That was 2889. You go ahead. 2889. 2989. 2989. That's what I said, right? It said 2889. Okay. You said you're going to maintain 35? Yes. Uh, yes. Approach on the 3272, 14,000, descend via the lucky one to 10,000. Chopper 3272, SoCal Approach, Roger. Cessna 9595 miles from Penny, turn right heading 260, maintain VFR, practice approach approved, no separation services provided. Turn right heading 260, uh, approach and uh, Markerway approved, 61959, Penny. Southwest 3272, descend via lucky one arrival and say approach request. Uh, clear to send via the uh, lucky one, and we'll take the RNF Zulu 27 south of uh, 3272. Southwest 3272, Roger. To send via lucky one, cleared for the RNF Zulu runway 27 approach. Alright, so 61959, maintain 3,500 until established. American 2700, is descending southbound now, just underneath Vida 2500 indicated. Still looking at America 2758. Cessna 61959, contact Montgomery Tower on 119.2, talk to you on the go. What's that, Montgomery down 119.2. Thank you. Have a good day. 61959. All right, so I said maintain 3-5 until established. All right. Fly first. Don't worry about the radios until you're you're good with flying. What heading do they tell us to maintain? 260. Okay, so let's get to 260 till we're till we're on. Once we get to Penny, we can go down to 3 Two five. Okay. Just letting you know. Okay. Well, we're wanting to cross. Actually, we're on the we're on the precision, so we're we're fine. Right, but we want to cross Penny at two five, right? Right. And when can we descend to two five? Once we cross. Uh, right now we're we in we're, we're in between Nesty and Penny. Once we're established, we can descend. Exactly. When are we established? Uh, once the this guy lines up. When it's within half scale, so right now. Right now. Okay. Yep. So right now we can start descending. We don't have to turn, but we can at least start descending. And for precision, non precision. But right now it's actually non precision. Okay. Because we're high. We're above the glide slope. We have to get down to 25 before Penny. Okay. So in this case, it's a combination of the two. Okay. As soon as we intercept the glide slope, then it's precision. Okay. But first we have to go down to 25. Okay, and make sure full at two five. Flaps ten. Good. Okay. Try to talk it back to me. Yep. Make sure that you keep the nose down to keep descending, because right now we're still high. Three, three, yeah. Six, one, one, okay. Say again. Twenty one one November. Roger. Try to maintain ninety. Holy. Okay. Still got to catch up to this. Say keep the power out. Power yeah. out. Okay, power, power out. at 15. Because we want to maintain this descent rate. Right. Okay. Just keep keep it down. Keep it down. There you go. Montgomery Tower six one nine or five nine is on the ILS. Just passing Penny. Or six one nine or five nine. Montgomery Tower runway two eight right. Clear for the option. Then right down departure. Clear for the option two eight right. Then right down one six one nine five nine. Thanks. Money one one November. All right, so we're a little bit high, uh, so we'll we'll just keep descending according to the glide slope. Yeah. Uh, but what you want to do is you need to cross Penny at two thousand five hundred, which we crossed it right at twenty five hundred. Okay. Um, the reason for that is because you have to intercept the glide slope from underneath. Two six member. We want the glide slope to come down to you, not you down to the glide slope. Okay. Okay. All right. All right. Now this approach will terminate in a touch and go. Are oh, we doing touch and goes? It, so we'll do a touch and go, and then we'll do a right down with departure for Brown. Okay. One well, number rolling. As soon as you reach minimums, uh, you'll lift up the foggles and you'll continue in for a touch and go. Okay. Uh, we're 2,000 feet, so we still got about 13 to go. Five one three golf from a two eight right. Clear for the option. Smooth. Two eight right. Clear for the option. Five yeah, definitely. Golf. It was smooth as glass. So six one nine five nine. Broken glass. Uh, so that's not right now. Want to be in the numbers. 
Instead of bringing the nose up, just bring it okay. level. Thousand feet to go. Okay. Good. Fish. Bring it at level. Just right there. Level. Yep. Perfect. Okay. Yep. The idea is that you want to you want to stop descending, okay, not seven, climb three, three, to, to get to the right slope. Short to a right uh, yep. straight out departure. Plus one three three from Chile, Montgomery Tower, Roger. Two one three. Nine five nine is traffic turning final in sight. Plus nine five nine, Roger. Cool. Just be smooth with your corrections. And as it's coming down, it doesn't have to be centered before you, you pitch the nose down again. Just kind of anticipate it so that way you don't overshoot it too much. Okay. Because right, yeah, now, right now you're kind of going back and forth, kind of chasing it. Yeah. Um, so just hold the pitch right here. Okay. Try to maintain like 400, 300 feet per minute. It doesn't have to be uh, zero. Just okay. slower than, than, uh, than 500. 500 feet to go. Roger. You're doing good. You just gotta fight the turbulence. Uh, 300 feet to go? Yeah. All right, the mental math is using up most of my brain. Careful with the pitch, there you go. Yeah, I'm trying to level it off. Yep, you got it. Okay, 100 feet to go. Roger. There we are. Minimum. Airport in sight. Minimum. Okay. Okay, we're going to do a landing and then write down wind departure. Okay. Affirmative. Pull the power out a little bit more because we got to slow down so we can put flaps in. Oh, that's what we're doing. That's what's going on. Yep. Why are we going in so fast? My first time actually touching the runway. Wait, really? I've never been here. What? Oh, at Montgomery. Got it. Flaps up. Three, three, and from Chile. Runway two eight right. Line up and wait. Traffic right down. Line up and wait. Two eight right. Three nine. Right. We're at sixty. Up. Five one three. Golf traffic is holding in position. Roger, okay. 5128, golf. Alright, you're pitching for VY. I'll advise you of your right turn. You can bring the foggles back down. Okay. Oh, and when I advise, you'll turn right to a heading of 090. Okay. And for now, maintain 5 degrees right. 3 from Charlie. 5 degrees right. 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 Not available. Clear for takeoff, 28 right, 3 to for Charlie. So 513, golf, from my 28 right, to cover the option. Alright, and uh, you're good to turn right to 090. 090. Let's pitch up for VY. Yeah, let me just get the trip up. 2226 okay. November, Montgomery Tower, runway 28 left, clear for takeoff, left traffic. Left traffic, clear for takeoff, 28 left, 26 November. I'll tell you right now, it feels like I'm heading directly into the sun. Oh, really? I feel like this plane is like this. <laughs> Pretty cool. Yeah. All right, so what are we doing next? All right, we got to get ready for the approach to... Okay. ...to uh, uh, Brown. Yeah. I'm also flying the plane. That you are. Zero, 090. Five, nine, zero. Five, contact. So, cut departure, one, two, four, point, three, five. Contact, cut departure, one, two, four, point, three, five. Six, nine, or five, nine, or. 
one nine five eight <laughs> one mile north. Get ahead of yourself. So if you are through Bravo Airspace, you're hitting one zero zero. Maintain vehicle. Right. So we're not talking to SoCal yet. So let's take advantage of this time and see if we can get a little bit ahead of ourselves. Uh, I'm trying to do this. Uh, whatever. Southwest 2659. We'll push procedure. Just push procedure. Number car 1185. 1198. Test 958. Say all your purchase request. Request Montgomery ILS. ILS missed local letter Delta back to Glassby Full Stop. Set 9958. Test 958 on request. Six one nine five nine. So can approach you. So can approach. There's a six one nine or five nine. You're at two thousand, heading to zero nine zero. Six one nine five nine. That's not six one nine five nine. Roger, you are cleared through Bravo airspace via direct hail. Join final approach course for the VOR Alpha approach into Brownfield. Cleared through the Bravo for VOR Alpha approach Brownfield six one nine five nine. Thank you. No nine five nine. Maintain VOR Alpha two thousand eight hundred. Maintain VFR at or below 2,800, 6,100. So they also say go direct to hail. They say go direct hail. So direct to hail. So direct hail. Hail. There you go. Okay, so let's finish loading up the approach, and then we'll go direct to that fix. Okay. 900,000 and expecting vectors on our own Oh, yep, that's fine. That's fine. Barrow, find the plane. Out of below 2800. Let's go to 2800. Uh, go ahead and activate the approach. We can actually set the minimums later. Because uh, they want us to go. I mean, can VFR practice approach approved. No separation services provided. Practice approach approved. Uh, 6959 Brown. Thank you. Cool. So now go scroll down to hail. We'll push direct. Seven zero not the left. Direct. Contact Windsor Tower one one eight point three. One zero left. And then enter twice. Just push enter twice. Yep. There you okay, go. Cool. All right. Now, what EDI do we have to use? Hold on. That's not six one nine five eight. Turn right, heading one eight zero. There you go. Yep. You're good. You're all right. Just too much going on. So navigate first. Okay. So we we're going direct to hail. Okay. So that's. So what CDI do we use? I want to know. Oh, that's not it. There you go. That's it. Yep. So you want the magenta one. Data. If you're using the GPS, everything is magenta. 6500. Okay, cool. So we're going direct to hail. Okay. What are we going to do after we pass hail? Start uh, getting ready for this approach to Brown. Okay. Uh, we go to procedure, select. Hang on. You're, you're wanting to set the minimums? Is that what you're trying, is that what you're wanting to do? Are you wanting to set the minimums? Uh, we're gonna no. be, uh, okay, to so instead of going and loading the approach again, um, you can stay at 2800, that's fine. Okay. Yeah, just stay at 2800. Um, you're going to go in here, and where it says Barrow Minimums down here, you're just going to scroll all the way down to the bottom, and then you can set your minimums right there. Uh, 1380. And we're actually going to go to 1140 right here. We'll talk about that on the ground. Sounds so good. maintain 2800 first. Yep. Back on so, track. bring your power in, because that, that's why we're descending. Test 958 for heading 200. So let's get back up. Just go full power, since we want to climb. Test 959, I'm going to ask, but advise information in the for Brown. We will advise information in the for Brown, we get it. 61959. Okay. Aviate, navigate, communicate. Finish loading up the approach and everything. Don't worry about, you know, um, so for now, worry about you know what you're what you're doing next on the approach. Right. Back to two eight. Turn right a little bit. Okay. Okay. One second. Okay, there we go. So it'll say turn now. One fifty six. Okay. That's pretty cool. Yeah, it comes in handy. Alright, centered, okay, cool. Alright, 61958, you're about 5 miles from Penny, turn right heading right, 250, do do maintain VFR, practice project approved. That's not us, it's 958. Okay. Sorry, oh, yeah. Right, so how do you zero, I want to activate the lag, too. 1148. traffic, just over Penny, southbound, that's the one. So you'll just scroll up to the top. 
go. Like cool. And then you'll close out of that. By pushing the timer. Okay. Left, in about four miles. That's the 172 descending westbound for Brown or for Montgomery out of 4,000. 959 is looking for traffic. All right, so we've passed Hale. What do we do next? I want to try and activate the leg further. The leg is actually already activated. Okay. All right, so we're brief we need to brief the approach. Got okay. that. So, first... Clear to so, get the weather. No, no, no. We're on the approach. So we can't brief the approach anymore because we're on it. Okay. So, what's the altitude between Hale and Finley? Hale and Finley, 4,000 and 240. So if we're at Hale, we can just head to 240. Okay. So at this point... Forget about briefing the approach, forget about the ATIS, forget about Warren Beck, just fly the approach. Okay, just fly the approach. Yep. Um, I want now, to get the ATIS too. Uh, oh, I would say leave the ATIS for last. Okay. Um, so what you, 61959, traffic, no factor, go ahead and contact Brown Tower now, 128.25, talk to you on the go. We'll contact Brown Tower, 128.25, thank you, 61959. There are nine, Romeo, Juliet, Right, so... Um, we want to make sure that the nav is set for the approach. So we're, it's not a GPS approach, it's a VOR approach. Um, so we want to make sure that the VOR is set correctly. Right. You know. So we have this. We're good on that. Okay. We want to switch that frequency over. Okay. It's for calm. Right. So we're over here. There you go. Okay. Now we can switch the CDI to nav one. Okay. There you go. Yep, there that's it, it right that's there. It. Okay. okay. All right. Let me get back now to 2.4. That's fine. So, yeah. We got um, 2.4 miles to the next fix. Okay. Yep. And, uh, yeah. Now, because we went direct to hail, that's why you didn't have to activate the leg. Okay. So we went direct to that fix, and then as soon as we passed it, it took us on the rest of the approach. Okay. Got a 2.4? Right. Okay, cool. cool. All right, sweet. How should the aircraft be configured right now? Should be full ridge flaps 10. It already was full rich. Exactly. Right, what altitude are we going down to? 2-4. Okay. There it is. Okay, 50 feet to go. Uh, let's try and level it off. Now, who are we talking to? Uh, Brown Tower. Okay. Yeah. Brown Tower, 6 to the 6, 1, 9, or 5, 9, or at 2,400 feet from Finley. 6, 1, 9, 5, 9, or. Cessna 6, 1, 9, or 5, 9, or Brown Tower, report over Pogi and your VFR. Turn to the northeast. I'll report over the VF Pogi and turn to the northeast, 6, 1, 9, or 5, 9, or. Down, we can just send to 1380. Okay. Now, when you contact tower, all you really have to say is the approach that we're on. You'll just say on on the VOR Alpha. VOR Alpha. Okay. Yep. Just try and minim minimize your your time on the radios. Okay. And you said we're going down to 1380. Yep. Okay. Once we go over Pogi, turn to northeast. You'll do. You'll start a left turn to heading zero three zero. Okay. And it's a circling, circle to land kind of deal. Uh, yes, but we're not going to land. We're, we're actually oh, going right. to go miss from this one. Okay. Well, we'll head back to Gillespie. Right. Five hundred feet to go. All right, that's not even. My math's not even close. Yeah, it is. I'm good. Ten eighty. But we pass Zeklu just now. So we're going down at minimums, 1140. Cool. So pull your power to 15, 
What descent rate are we maintaining? 100. 100. Perfect. So we crossed Zeklu about 200 feet high. Um, so if you if you didn't increase your descent rate, then we would have been high so tower at uh, the missed approach point. Three miles okay. to the north inbound. Number 6049 Sierra, Brown Tower. He's just looking for a full stop. Affirmative 490. I'm going to be uh, parking in a transient for about four to five hours. Number 490 Sierra, only 26 right, clear to land. 26 right, clear to land. And I guess there was a plane uh, in Once we get to that uh, point that zero, uh, we'll uh, turn for me. northeast. Yeah, they're right below you right now, 1,200, but they're about to start start a turn right. to the northeast. Or did I say uh, 40? That's what I meant. Okay, 26 right. Make sure that you're tracking that course. Yep. yep, we're past it. Okay. okay. There we go. Turning northeast. Six one nine or five nine. Start your turn to the northeast. Maintain VFR outside of the Bravo and contact SoCal approach on one two four point three five. Have a good day. Uh, we'll maintain outside of the Bravo. We'll contact approach at one two four three five six one nine five nine. Thank you. Back. So yep. remember, we're going missed. Oh, we're going so now. as soon as you pass the VOR, field not in sight, full power, pitch the nose up. Okay. You can maintain heading zero three zero. Zero three zero. Okay. Did wanted it. So no aircraft in sight then, or no airport uh, in sight on one. No, negative. I've never been to Brown either. Oh uh, really? Yeah. That's a fun one. One, one, super one, long. One, one of these days we'll go there. Yeah, the runway's crazy long. It's like eight, eight to ten thousand feet. Oh. What else did you do, sir? Uh, we'll climb up to 3,000 for now. Okay. Uh, but for now, uh, maintain heading 030 and just contact SoCal. Traffic in sight, we'll maintain visual separation. Approach out of 671 out of 13,000, descending to the Comet 2 with Yankee. Giant 671, Comet 2 is going to maintain 5,000. Going to maintain 5,000 at 671. SoCal approach, send us 61959 at 1800, climbing to 3,000. System 61959, SoCal approach, climbing 360, start heading off the right. Heading 360, 61959, we have chutes in sight. Jack 959, close to Bravo airspace, remain out or below 5,000. Same thing. Clear through Bravo airspace, remain out or below 5,000, 61959. I was going to ask if the OTI jump zone was... Fighting zero one zero ten ten. Oh. They do they do parachutes up here? Yeah. Okay. All right. This is 61959, fighting zero two 